the man to watch. He starts today, but might he be retiring? Stay with us for all the action on EA TV. And hello to you from Clydeside. We find ourselves on the south side of this great city, Glasgow. I'm Derek Ray, joined for commentary by the former Arsenal defender Lee Dixon. And it's the Champions League round of 16 second leg. It's Rangers up against Inter. Well, we had goals in the first leg. Is the tie over? Big advantage for the home side tonight. Surely the away side need an early goal to change the complexion of this one. Well, here's the starting 11 for Rangers. It does appear that they're throwing caution to the wind, Lee. I'm not so sure I'd enjoy playing in a, a system where my back four is basically left on its own. The two midfield players will try to support the forwards, but most of their job today will be defending. The four up front need to score. And a look at the Inter team. Samir Handanovic begins in goal. Alexander Kolarov starts with Milan Striniar in central defence. Christian Eriksen starts alongside Marcelo Brozovic in the centre of midfield. And the tactical configuration has two players in attack from the very outset. Tevez. Kent and in possession Morelos can he take the chance and a goal that is a very bright start perfect way to open well the gulf in quality has been marked on aggregate it's 5-0 Ericsson, Romelu Lukaku now, and he's through here. Well, a moment he would dearly love to have back. Well, listen, he's tried to hit it too hard. Just relax a little bit, focus on your technique. In behind for him to chase. Well, good defending, clattered out of there. Takes it on. Well, he failed to deliver that time. Well, goalkeeper mistake. Will there be a price to pay? Can he finish? Oh, tremendous block. It might be. And the ball is loose. But it looks so threatening, but the danger averted. Well, there's no getting away from it. This is the man so many people have been focusing on ahead of this particular game. If you believe the stories coming out of the camp, this could be his final season. Could he be thinking about hanging up his boots? Well, Derek, if those rumours are true, it's going to be a big loss for this club. They've really come to love him here. His performances have been superb. To be fair, when you get to a certain age, it's really hard to keep the body going. Not so much in the matches, it's the training, really. Wouldn't be a surprise if he did retire. Aribo, not troubling the keeper. Eriksson. Hakimi. 
Room to manoeuvre on the wing. Speculative ball fired to the near post. Oh, it's a goal! And certainly a deflection off the defender into the back of the net. So just to confirm the aggregate scoreline in this tie, 5-1 it is. Romelu Lukaku. And there to intervene. Aribo. Oh, nice ball over the top to chase. Well, they can say a big thank you to the goalkeeper. That was inspirational. Well, that's as good as a goal at the other end. Brilliant save from the keeper. Martinez. Making excellent progress with the ball at his feet. Hakimi. Cross could be useful. That is what you call a guilt-edged opportunity not taken. Well, you visualise the game before you play it, and I'm pretty sure he probably in his sleep visualised an open goal, and he's just fluffed his lines. Fair play to the keeper. He really anticipated that moment of subtlety. Well, he came off his line, he gave the space behind, but what a good save in the end. Bad challenge, and now it's up to the referee in terms of what to do next. Ashley Young, Barella, the ball with Martinez, Young, fruitful looking attack, now he must favour the cross, Lukaku, and it's two for him today, a masterful performance, the defenders unable to stop him. The aggregate lead they have stands at five goals to two. Nicely timed tackle. So the whistle then, we're up the half. So the Champions League, round of 16, second leg. The second half is underway. Brozovic. Ball lost by Inter. James Tabernier. Carlos Tevez. And a friendly reminder that we have more action from the Premier League coming up. It's Rangers taking on Brighton. Yeah, it's very easy to build a case for those two teams to make that game a real cracker. You should be tuning in for that one. Can they hit on the break? Young. Oh, the referee points to the spot. Penalty. A goal it is, a confidently taken penalty. Festival of attacking football, 5-3 on aggregate. Hakimi. Defended well. Well, he'd be disappointed if he didn't take that one cleanly. Half an hour remaining then. Lukaku. Young. No real conviction in the challenge. A foul, but advantage played. Straight forward for the keeper. Fabregas. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. And he's in. A goal! He's 
dispatched it, much to the sheer delight of the fans. Plenty of work for the scoreboard operators on this tie, 6-3 on aggregate. Well, he's got plenty of space on the flank here. Brozovic. Barella has it. And the advantage accrues to the attacking side. Well, how close was that? Inches away. Substitution for Inter. Coming off the pitch. Number nine, Romelu Lukaku. To be replaced by number seven, Alexis Sanchez. Fabregas. And a blunder by the keeper. And he's done well to tip it over the bar. Well, he's given a corner, the referee. And over from Ericsson. That's all they can conjure for now. Oh, what's he gone and done? Well, a poor attempt at a challenge, and on he goes. Not really close to worrying the scoreboard operator. No, it's worth a try, though, but when he looks at the position he is in, he'll be disappointed he didn't hit the target. Not to be advised giving the ball away there. Trying to lob the keeper. And in! Oh, yes! Exactly what they were hoping to produce. They've delivered the goal. Well, both sides know how to finish. 6-4 on aggregate here. Fabregas. Connor Goldson. Well, it's a great advantage to any side when you're as comfortable on the ball as they are. Good pressure high up the pitch. Well, just couldn't keep the ball. Can he finish? And it goes! And now they need one more to go through. Can they do it? And the aggregate advantage stands remarkably at 6-5. Getting forward. Superb defensive judgment to end the attack. We have entered the final minute of normal time. And just one minute of time added on for stoppages. And they did have the ball, but not anymore. There's the final whistle, the home foul.